shit. How did you get here? I'm everywhere, fucker. I didn't do anything, Jack. Yeah, I know. Well, then tell these guys that I'm not a terrorist. I'm not telling anybody anything until you answer a few questions. Unless you want to spend the next few years of your life behind bars, you're going to tell the truth. No more lies, you understand? No more lies. Did you do this? Just answer the questions. Did you have me taken off that plane? Put your hand over here. You're sick. You know that? Is your name Gaylord Fokker? Yes. Are you a male nurse? Yes. Are you a pothead? No. Have you ever smoked pot? Yes. Did you spray paint the tail of a cat in order to pass it off as Mr. Jinx? Yes. Did you do that because you were desperately trying to seek my approval? Yes. Because you love my daughter? Yes. Do you want to marry her? Do you want to marry her? I did. That is until I met you. Well, now what is that supposed to mean? I love your daughter, Jack. I love her more than anything. But frankly, sir, I'm a little bit terrified of being your son-in-law. And this whole weekend has given me doubts about whether I can survive in your family or not. And I think you have some serious issues. If I lighten up, would you consider marrying my daughter? <laughs> would you lighten up a lot? Yeah. Yes or no? Okay, yes. Would you let me and Pam live our own lives without interfering all the time? I promise not to interfere. And will you stop making fun of me for being a nurse? Would you just consider another profession? Jack. Ever? Yes or no? Yes. Would you let me and Pam sleep in the same bed? Well, now you're pushing it, Fokker. L listen. If you marry my daughter, you promise to support her in the way she means to be supported. Yes. And do you promise to be faithful to her? Yes. And do you promise to take care of her for the rest of her life? Of course. Gaylord Fokker. Will you be my son-in-law? <laughs>